Hello folks, I'm OdinSpack33, and welcome back to Fire Emblem 7 Yubin's Randomizer. This is part number 51. If this is your first time ever seeing this, all of my units are random, and it's, because, and it's called Yubin's Randomizer because my lords have been replaced with various enemy characters. Well, my main lords, anyway. Well, I guess there's no other main lords than that. And Yubin's is the main character. Why am I saying that 51 parts in? Because you never know, but let's use Yubin's here to talk to Nino and get her to join my team. As I mentioned in the last part, Nino has some really solid bases and would be a good unit, but it's so late in the game and some of her growths are kinda not that great. I mean, she's good, but I'm gonna hold off on using her. All right, so I'm gonna get Priscilla to heal up uh, Marcus because I'm not really concerned about Marcus, or I'm not really concerned about Nino, I should say. Nino's gonna be sitting in the back, not taking any damage. Although she does need to make her way over to Jafar to talk to him. So that does need to happen. So where can Priscilla go and where can I send Marcus? Well, I can send them as far as possible, actually. That's fantastic. So there's actually an item that I need to get for Marcus here. Uh, it's in one of those treasure chests, and had I had been unsuccessful in killing that thief with bolting, probably wouldn't have been getting it, so I got lucky. I used some strategy, I used some wit, and it paid off, so that's good. Alright, Oswin, because I'm not really scared for him at all. I'm just going to set him down here. So he's got thunder. What's his resistance like? Eh, it's not very good, is it? That's fine. We'll also send Geitz down here as well, help assess the situation. He also doesn't have very good defense. What? A luck of 10. Is this guy... Okay, he can't crit. So I don't really care. I feel like he's gonna go... If I put a javelin on with guides, he's probably gonna go after Osman. Which is just a bad move. Okay, so yeah, we do actually need to send Nino down here. I don't think she's in range of anything. Uh, actually, I don't know. There might be mounted units. I'm not 100% sure. There could be. I should probably give her something to defend herself with. Meanwhile, on the left side of the map, uh, there's units that spawn out of here, so we got to watch out for that. Now, some of my units are higher level than others. So, let's use glass to strike down a fool. Just one-shot him. Like this. Bam! Glass, although maybe really weak, he is, as we know, a glass cannon. Doing some big damage. Maybe he'll get a speed stat this level up. No, he got strength and skill as per the norm. Uh, his his speed growth is 25%. As I mentioned last part, he's only gotten one speed stat since he joined the team. Although that could he could have had a different speed growth when uh, it was Glass's Saga, because the characters that are in that, some of them actually have different growths, and he would be he's one of them. So it's possible that he had a very low speed growth then, and I'm just being go gotten unlucky since. But come on, it's really garbage. <laughs> so yeah, I'm probably going to keep using uh, Ninny's Grace, though, on Glass whenever I want to send him in uh, to, to wreck some guys up. Because it if I give him Ninny's Grace, he won't actually be too bad, because I'll put his defense and resistance up to 19 and 8. So then he, he can actually block for a turn. <laughs> Alright. Who else needed experience? I guess it was just these two, eh? Everyone else is level 4 for the most part. We'll get Sane some experience, get him up there. Get him some sword experience. Crystal sword. Hopefully my controller isn't as loud, by the way. I noticed it really loud in the last part. I'm actually using a different one. Not that I disliked the one I was using, it was it's actually an Xbox One controller. I'm using my old standby, my old Logitech one that I got forever ago. Um, I can't remember if I actually bought it for Let's Playing. I may have, back in the emulator days, which this is. You know it. I know it. But Yeah, back back in back in the days where I mostly did that kind of stuff, before I had the technology to record games. So this guy had a door key and he just kind of like, yo, I'm gonna open it up. Okay, that's really weird. 
wonder why I did that. Maybe because uh, Galt killed the thief or something. I don't know. That is really strange. I honestly should camp someone over here uh, by these stairs. I want to say that shamans keep appearing out of the stairs. So I could just leave Rebecca here. And she could just destroy them. Because light magic is superior to dark magic. We haven't really seen that yet. But it, it's a thing. <laughs> Alright, like all got hit. I got hit? 45. Alright. He had enough luck in the last part with all the criticals and stuff, so I guess it had to happen. And he, oh, he's weapon level S now with sword. Sweet. Oh, Jafar's out of hand axe? I didn't realize that ran out. Well, that sucks. Alright, well, now we need to get over to him fast, because even though he is a beast, um, he can probably take some damage and he can't kill guys now. So, yeah, he might just stand here and take hits, so... We gotta go save him. But that's good, because most of our units are over there anyway. Oof. What's this here? I didn't even see this guy. I didn't see any of these guys. Were they all hidden in that little, like, two squares there? It's pretty garbage. <laughs> Alright. Well, that's this sucks. I guess we should kill this guy, because he's probably one of the most... He has an Elysian Whip? Why? He's a bishop. Okay, but Osmond took some big damage. I think it was mostly from all of these guys, actually. Whoa. Maybe we might want to consider withdrawing and let them come after me. That might be a thing. Because there's two other guys over here as well, right? I don't think anyone even went after Geitz. Oof, that's actually really bad. <laughs> Alright. We're gonna, need to get, we're gonna have to pull an audible here. We're gonna put Eubens up here because he's got the magic resistance. Okay, one second here. Let's try to see what happens if I were to try and get him in range. Where one, two, three, four, five, six. Two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, if I put Eubens here, put him on with a bow, Geitz can get here. Could probably rescue Oswin. Just barely. Can Barter rescue him? Probably not. Can Merlinus rescue him? That's, that's not a thing. I didn't know if that was a thing or not. So unfortunately, Eubens is in the way, but I'm not really concerned about him because he's got, you know, he's packing that, those stats. Alright, let's see what's over here. Like right here. That should be a, a good, I should have put it over further, whatever. Let's see what's in this hallway. So we got a knight. So no one's going after Zephiel, they could care less about him. Barter's just going for the. He's just making a break for those treasure chests there. Okay. So Marcus has. He has 11 resistance, which is pretty solid. So he probably should help down here. It's actually got a lot tougher <laughs> than I realized. What's His constitution sucks, right? Yeah, he needs speed. Big time. So we're gonna put him on the javelin anyway. And we need to get Nino over here. We'll bring Merlinus too. So that side's got a lot to deal with. Now this side needs to go rescue Jafar. Before he dies. Because even though I didn't realize his hand axe wore out. He does have elixir, so hopefully he's not stupid. Usually the computer will move away when they go to heal themselves. So hopefully he just doesn't... He's going to get surrounded. Who am I kidding? He's going to get surrounded. Okay, 
Okay, that's not good. Glass has chest keys, right? So he's gotta go down here. Okay. Alright. I, I know he, he's like an experience point away. And that guy would, would totally die. Yeah, it was kill him. Kill him was saying, we'll just get him this level up. Let me get Guy level up. That probably would have been enough for Guy, too. Oh well. Doesn't matter. Ugh. We got HP and strength. He's got a lot of hit points. I think he has a really high HP growth, so. That would explain why. But yeah, he's packing quite the HP pool. Which is what Guy could use. But he has like a 5% growth, I think, so. That ain't happening. Okay, so if I can maybe lure this guy after Legault. Because, like, Jafar probably has some decent resistance, right? Whereas Legault does not. So if I can get him to come after Legault, then maybe he will. It's something, right? Yeah, I, I was debating staying up there, but yeah, it's whatever. Alright, you know what, let's move the glass up here so we can get those treasure chests. I thought about moving Rebecca too, but I want glass to get those get those chests. That fat loop. Alright. Oh he's going uh, knight's going after Going after Zephiel, that's no good. That's no good at all. But yeah, they can't even do any damage to him. <laughs> this guy can, though. That's the problem. But I mean, at 50% with only 5 damage, I guess it's not really a big threat. All right. Yeah, I saw this coming. I figured this guy was over here. Unless this is a different shaman? Which I guess is also possible, because apparently there was just a billion guys over here. If that weapon didn't weigh him down so much, that definitely would have been a double. Okay, look, I made this work, guys. Look at this. Even if that hits, like, no damage, whatever. I'm gonna double you, because that's probably weighing you down. Yubins don't got speed. That's the only way he doubles, guys. That's why he's great against mages, because all their spells weigh them down. Oh, nice. Oh, wow. I'll take it. I'll take it. It's no HP or speed, but I'll still take it. I'll take your Elysian Whip, too, for some reason. I don't have a flyer I can use it on. But Layla, I guess. Just, she's not on level 10. Alright, so we need to book it to this guy over here. Like, hardcore book it. And Nino needs to get over here to talk to Jafar. We're actually gonna. What we're gonna do. Ah, we can't. It's five movement? Come on. Well, whatever. It's not like. It's not like Priscilla is in danger if I put her down here. Yeah. Am I even showing that off if that happens? Oh, she has bolting on. Fodge. <laughs> oh, well. Didn't realize that. Alright, let's just move down here with Ubens. Come at me, bras. I know there's another guy down there. So I can't move Oswin to convoy. Oswin has to convoy himself. Which is kind of dumb. That should be like an advantage to being able to move Merlinus around. Alright. Let's get some loot here. I got boots. Increases movement. This is actually a really unique item. Like, increases movement by two, not one, by two. Uh, those are the only pair in the game. I don't know if there's a guy in there. I hope not. Just so, he's gonna get shrecked. Man, talking to Jafar is actually gonna suck, because Ursula's in the way here. She doesn't have a longbow, does she? No. Okay, so I should start dealing with these guys. Yeah, I'm fine with using a Steel Axe. I, I'm gonna level it up now, and I got S-Rank Swords. I'll use a sword if I need to. But it's still good to have. I could just give him like a Silver Sword or something like that. Just probably wreck everybody. 
Guy has this rank. Lances too. Does Spear give you 10 critical? No, it gives you 5. So I'm, I'm pretty sure... Like, I'm, I'm almost certain anyway. Okay, this guy doesn't have armor slayer, right? No. So I'm almost certain... That because he has S rank, like S rank weapons give you a higher critical. Yeah, because like, look at this. This only says five, but it's giving me another five. So it must give you another five critical. It, it has to. Yeah, any lance is giving him a plus five to critical. So, like it has to. These guys are refusing to come after me. I'm pretty sure if you kill Ursula, the chapter doesn't end. But I'm kind of afraid to. But I'm, I'm almost positive. Like almost. <laughs> just, just almost. Okay, so maybe I should use Rebecca to heal somebody. Is somebody hurt? I don't know. You know what's funny is like once I kill everybody, like the rest of this chapter is just gonna be like me waiting around. Could heal Sarah. <laughs> Give Sane this one hit point here. See, the thing is, I don't really have to do this anymore. Now that Rebecca can attack people, it's not a big deal. Although I can get her to uh, S rank stabs, ideally. Oh, there's a general over here too, eh? Okay, this hero can't even do any damage to Jafar. Okay, yeah, I have a bow on, so I can't counter attack. There was no way I could have unless I had a hand axe, really. That was like the only way. That I was gonna guarantee an attack here. Okay, yeah, this was this is gonna happen. Good. It's waiting for this to happen. But yeah, you're this is <laughs> guaranteed gonna hit. Of course, I got bolting on, weighs me down, but no damage. <laughs> oh, even gonna double too. That see, bolting just weighs a ton. Good thing that wasn't like a dangerous situation. Alright, someone did spawn over there, and someone spawned from the bottom as well, too. Okay. There we go. This will mess you up. I only got eight uses of this left, though. That should be enough for the chapter. I probably could just use Eubens to finish all these guys off over here. Or Priscilla. I didn't really have to bring both of them. Eubens can't even kill this guy. Man, I should just give him a silver axe. I don't know why I haven't. Because now this, this is going to be another waste of a turn here. Oh well. He has no speed. Alright, can I get at this guy with Marcus? I can. Alright, let's do it. Maybe I'll get a crit. Eh. That's alright. He's not going to kill me. Obviously I just doubled him there, so... Not really concerned about that. Alright, so this is where we're in a little bit of a hairy situation. It's not so bad. As long as I don't get in range of Ursula and just start taking out these guys. And some more guys did spawn, but they're, they're like over there. So I'm not really too concerned. I should heal the gull, but... I'm gonna probably regret it by making Rebecca attack this knight. It's fine. Just get everybody in there. Take these guys out. Jafar is fine. He's not in any danger. Yeah, she's actually pretty solid. Besides that low magic stat, she's pretty, pretty solid. Not like, not spectacular. It's just solid. Okay, we'll take out this hero. Can't take him out just like that. Does the gold have a throwing weapon? No. What can she do? 33, eh? That'd be quite a lot. She wouldn't double him unless I weigh him down. So, iron blade. Ooh, a little hairy. I could throw out this mage guy with Guy. I'll do that. Oh, yes! All the crits. Like, as soon as he S ranks, he's just getting all the crits. Which is really funny, because, like, he would normally be a sword master, and, like, they have a natural crit bonus. But obviously, Guy doesn't. He got speed. Nice.
So this is really funny. See, if I put Eric there, like, I'm not really afraid for him. He's got 18 defense. Like, even if this guy attacks, that's only 3 damage. <laughs> See, the Galt's hurt. That's the only problem. But yeah, he can take out this hero. I don't have any kind of healing items. I'm, maybe I could trade for that elixir. I think you can trade with green units for their items. I think. I can. You can rescue them though, but he's probably got a lot of constitution. Yeah. I don't know if I have anyone over here with that kind of constitution. Oh, he does. He's 14, right? Who's rescuing a sane? Wouldn't be a wise move though. Alright, so there is a guy up here. So what I should do is I should put on the light brand. Because he's probably going to attack me. Or attempt to, anyway. Brave Lance. Yeah! We have a brave sword, right? And we have a brave axe as well, so... Do we have a brave bow? Does Eric, is Eric rocking that? If, if I have it, he would be have it on. Oh yeah, he does. That's for when situations get real bad. All right, we can start getting this stuff too. All right, Delphi Shield, that is what we want. So this protects uh, flying units from bows. So that's pretty sweet. Now our our Pegasus can be protected from speaker systems. So that was really stupid, like bow and arrows. <laughs> and who's gonna be getting that? Well, it's this dude right here. We gotta do at least one more turn, though. Nino still needs to make her way over here. There's no one in the way. I have those elixirs. I could heal up. One, two, three, four, five. See, even if I move... the gulp... This guy can't get at, um... Her... Because they only have five movement, right? Generals, yeah. Can't get a Rebecca. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, no. He'd be... She'd be safe. Honestly, I'm not really too afraid of him. That's the only unit I haven't moved, right? And Merlinus? Okay. I know some units spawn in the bottom left. That's the only ones I'm really worried about. Ugh. That's fine. Zephyl tanked it. That's good. That's the only hit he needed to tank. This whole... Whole game. No one else is gonna bother him now. I'm glad I used Marcus to hit him. I don't know if he... He wouldn't have got double. Actually, if anything, uh, Zephyl would have doubled him. I don't think he would have, though. The knight could have been pretty slow. Alright. Got the weapon triangle advantage here with the light brand. Yeah, it counts as light magic, which is pretty cool. Oh, even that double, too. Sweet. I can just leave glass here, and you can just camp here and let all those guys spawn and come after him. Okay, he's gonna move. Wait, that's not good. Because now if units spawn here, units can move on to here and attack him. No, no, no. You ain't doing that. Nah. Uh-uh. No? You ain't going over there. I'll just leave Marcus here for the rest of the game. Or the, re the rest of the game. Yeah. With him there. Alright, rescue staff. That's pretty good. Uh, teleports guys like out of danger towards the uh, staff user. Alright, we gotta get... Nino's almost there. Then I gotta rescue her. Then I gotta kill the boss. Some units did spawn over here, but they're just not appearing, I guess? Or maybe they moved and they just couldn't get over here this turn? I don't know. I'm gonna go over there with Guy. Check it out. Guy's one of our safer units to send over there, even though he has low hit points. He's got that uh, defense. Galt's almost up a level up. They're all level 5, right? I guess we can get the Galt that level. Well, no we can't. Well, let's attack with him anyway. Wow, that defense. Yeah, generals have a lot, I guess. Unless I get a critical. <laughs> I said that. I was like, in hopes. Maybe it'll happen. I almost got a level Alright, you should be able to kill, though. Probably kill with... No, I can't even kill with a short bow. Eh, we'll 
we'll use the silver bow. Old tried and true right here, silver bow. Tons of experience. Yeah, I, I, I probably won't actually kill the boss until I'm certain I've talked to Jafar, just in case. Oh, there's a mage over here. Okay. That's fine, everybody's healed up. Maybe there's another mage over there too. Who knows? Not really afraid. Alright, so we gotta get Nino down here. Actually, can Nino... What's her constitution? 10? It's more in Florina. We'll wait till next turn to do this. Although, what we could do... Is we could play for Rebecca here, and she could heal up Nino. For some experience, and because she's actually hurt. Just, just in case. Someone comes from behind, or some stupidness happens. All right, so that's what Nino looks like as a good guy, as a good guy. Yeah, pretty, <laughs> pretty messed up palette. Maybe she'd look cool if she promoted, just like Legault. Legault looked weird too, remember? And he got his chance to shine. So I still got to deal with this guy. With I, I guess with Eubens. Doesn't really matter. Eubens doesn't have to seize no thrones this chapter, so it's good. Yeah, I guess this will be the last. This is this one. This uh, it's actually taking longer than the last part. I don't know why. I'm gonna light up here just like in case something decides it wants to spawn. I don't think it will. By it, I mean like a person. <laughs> and Osmond's hurt. I should heal him up. I kind of want to leave glass here. Maybe units will go after him. And you just mess him up. Yeah, of course you're going to go after the goal. Oh, and he gets that level up. Sweet. Alright, we get to end the video with this. Ugh. Okay, pretty standard. <laughs> nothing really different there. Alright, nothing even spawned. Alright guys, next time on Yubin's Randomizer, we finish up... Battle Before Dawn, which is supposed to be difficult, but Jafar's hand axe made simple work of it. Alright, take care, and until then, goodbye.